Hey folks, Mike McFeely from the Mighty 790 KFGO, host of the Mike McFeely Show, heard each weekday, 2 to 5 p.m., right here on KFGO. I wanted to talk today on the McFeely Minute about permanent flood protection for Fargo-Moorhead. I know it's been in the news now for, gosh, three years, because it was three years ago that the big flood of 2009 hit us here in the Fargo-Moorhead area and the Red River Valley. What I'm worried about this winter, when it comes to permanent flood protection, is that we're not having much snow out there. It's been a dry winter. It's, what, January 20th today, and there's really just a dusting of snow on the ground. It's cold. It's very cold out there, but we're not getting a lot of snow. If this keeps up, we're not going to have any flooding. We're not going to have the 38, 39, 40-foot flood in Fargo-Moorhead. And what I fear is going to happen is that people are going to say, well, see, why would we spend $2 billion on a diversion when... It's only going to happen a bad flood, I don't know, once every three years. Heck, we might go to dry cycle now, right? Why spend this money? We can't be lulled into that. We, we just can't be. Uh, the leaders of Fargo-Moorhead, of the folks trying to put together the diversion, have worked too hard for too long and have gotten too far along in the process to have it submarined now by short-sighted thinking. So I know behind the scenes they're not going to let that happen. But I hope the public, when it comes to a diversion for permanent flood protection, protection, excuse me, for Fargo-Moorhead, I hope that people do not get lulled into thinking, well, it's a dry year. We're off the hook. We don't need permanent flood protection. We don't need this diversion in Fargo-Moorhead. No, we do need the diversion. We need to keep this thing moving forward. We need to get permanent, long-term, generational flood protection for Fargo-Moorhead sewn up as quickly as possible so we never ever have to worry about the things we were worrying about in 2009 and never, ever have to experience what Minot uh, had to experience back in June when they had their devastating record flood. Folks, you can hear more of me, Mike McFeely, every weekday, 2 to 5 p.m. on the Mighty 790 KFGO on the very aptly named Mike McFeely Show. We'll talk again.